Hello Sagittarius, I'm doing your bonus love reading. You were the most views out of all of the fire signs, so I'm going to be doing a quick bonus love reading for you. All right, spirit. Messages for Sagittarius. Some of you are dealing with a Libra. That's just that I had to say it. <laughs> okay, for Sagittarius, please, spirit. Messages regarding love for the rest of this month. For Sagittarius. This will be a general reading, Sagittarius, so it will not resonate with everyone watching. Keep that in mind. Take what resonates, leave the rest. If it doesn't resonate at all, then check back the reading that I did for you uh, a couple days ago, last week, um, or other uh, placements in your birth chart. Oh, wow. First one out. Man holding a heart. So this is like King of Cups for me. Does not have to be a male, but it could be a masculine energy. What else from Sagittarius? Angel of Balance. Wow, okay. So someone clearly wants to offer you something, maybe bring back balance to a situation. Okay. They're telling me that that's enough. Okay, so I'm going to pull a romance angel as well. What else for Sagittarius? What are the messages we have for Sagittarius in love for the rest of this month, Spirit? What are messages for Sagittarius for the rest of this month? Oh, okay. We got reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. And then bottom of the deck, stay optimistic about your love life. Okay. <laughs> so some of, okay. I know I'm going to get some comments like I'm not interested in the past. There you are, Sagittarius, by the way. Uh, I'm not interested in the past. I don't want the past back. That's fine. You don't have to take them back. I'm just telling you this, the message that I'm getting that there's someone from the past who wants to return. It does not have to be someone you have, have had a romantic connection with in the past. It could be someone, you know, from the past, it could even be a past life type of connection as well. For Sagittarius messages regarding love, please. All right, let's see what we got for you guys. Messages regarding love for Sagittarius for the rest of this month. Five of Cups reverse. Wow, Empress. What else for Sagittarius? The world reverse. There's unfinished business here. Someone wants to, I feel, get closure. You haven't gotten closure about a situation from the past, most likely. I feel like there's still someone here who thinks about what happened, who possibly sees you as an empress energy, or who wants to grow and manifest, plant seeds. But this is like unfinished business. Like something here has was not closed off properly or... Or someone, you know, has not officially closed this chapter. Tell me about this Five of Cups reverse. This is all about either regaining what was lost, having some sort of a recovery, or someone's just stuck in the past and is unable to move on. Tell me about the Five of Cups reverse. King of Wands reverse, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius and queen of wands. So I have a pair here, and there you are again at the bottom of the deck, temperance energy. I have a pair here, a king of wands and a queen of wands that are not really seeing eye to eye, not on the same page. This is that probably that balancing that needs to happen. This queen of wands, I feel, could be you here, Sagittarius, like you're good. You are magnetic, attractive, you are manifesting what you want. 
confident uh, in yourself, in your abilities. And then this other person is just kind of like, I'm not doing well. <laughs> Can I get one more? They're not doing as well as you. That's what I'm picking up on. Can I get one more for this Five of Cups reverse? Strength reverse, Leo energy. Um, I feel like this is someone that wants to regain control. Have the scales at the bottom here with the justice, Libra energy. Again, with the balance, it's like someone's trying to regain balance here regarding, yeah, regarding this connection with the Two of Cups. So it's like they want to make things right, but at the same time, it's like this is out of their control and they're, it, it, you know, maybe they're becoming impatient. Maybe they are um, wanting things to really work out for them. And so it's a little too much force here with the King of Wands reverse, Strength card reverse. Sometimes the King of Wands reverse, they can act without thinking and make things worse. So this person, I feel, is a little desperate. Like, I'm picking that up. Like, they really want to recover what was lost. Tell me about the Empress. Can you tell me about the Empress? Yeah, Five of Wands reverse. They don't want to fight anymore. They don't want there to be conflict anymore. It's like a truce. Like the, someone wants to have some sort of reconciliation. You know? No, let's not fight anymore. Tell me more about the Empress. Oh, Seven of Swords. What's this doing here? Two of Wands. Nine of Pentacles reverse. This person could have played you or had someone else. For some of you, this person is still attached to another party. And so they don't want, maybe you caught them doing that. Maybe this person has been avoiding like facing you or coming to terms with, you know, just being open about what happened. Let's see. Tell me more about this Empress. Yeah, this is like a player energy with the Knight of Wands reverse. Tell me more about... And, and by player energy, I mean someone that's not willing to commit. Tell me more about the Empress. Not willing or not able to commit. Tell me more about the Empress. Is the Empress here. Magician reverse. Yeah. Someone want, This person wants to manifest growth with you, but I feel like... There's something that you don't know or there's something they're not telling you. There's something that's not clear here. They want to recover what's been lost, but maybe it was their fault that caused them to lose it in the first place by not playing, not playing fair, by not being fair to you. Tell me about the world reverse. This is resonating for you. Please let me know in the comments how it's resonating for you. Did someone have someone else on the side here? Did they deceive you in some way? Or were their actions what like the reason why things ended or are in this state at this time? Tell me more about the world reverse. Yeah, Eight of Cups. Maybe you walked away from this person. Um, maybe they walked away from you, but things haven't been resolved. Tell me more about the world reverse. Let's see. Knight of Wands reverse. Yeah, it's like you left this person like you were not having it. Or, you know, they walked away because they walked away towards someone else. What in the world? Hold on. Tell me more about the world reverse. Okay, so this wanted to come out. The lovers reverse. Gemini energy. There could have been a breakup here, separation of some sort. Maybe this person, and here we go, we got the Six of Cups. King of Pentacles. 
this person regrets whatever decision they made and again i'm just getting the this like they're not over the past they're not over what happened they still think about the past but with the ace of swords reverse either there's no communication or an ace of wands reverse or deception um something just wasn't isn't able to get off the ground or or didn't happen here between you maybe deception caused a separation here perhaps your person needs to maybe they're in a marriage king of pentacles for me is someone's typically married but stepped out of their marriage strange i'm getting a lot of messages so i'm feeling like i might be reading for at least two groups of sagittarius uh people right now i feel like someone if they walked away there was no closure if you walked away this person had no closure um and i feel like whoever walked away was due to a separation or someone that wasn't able to commit wasn't didn't make promises they could keep that kind of energy So what is the potential outcome here? What's next? What's next for this connection? What's next for Sagittarius in love? What's next for Sagittarius in love? Wow, Ace of Cups, new love. Someone could be offering you a big cup here. That's that man holding a heart. Magician Reverse. Be careful. I have the Magician Reverse twice. It could be that there's someone around you you can't trust. Or this person could be um, trying to manipulate the situation, perhaps because they don't want to lose you. Or maybe there's something that's not manifested or delayed. My gosh. Can I please keep my cards in my hand? Can I get one more for what's next for Sagittarius in love? What's the potential outcome here? Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy with the Empress reversed. Yikes. I feel like this person sees you as this queen of pentacles and maybe there's an empress involved here. Yeah, because I have the nine of pentacles reverse and the three of swords reverse. Some of you are definitely dealing with a third party and I feel like this empress, um, I mean, if they are married with this queen of pentacles, then you're not happy. Um, if they're seeing you as this queen of pentacles, then their current partner is not happy. Someone here is not happy. And there's more than two interesting it's almost like this person still wants to have a new love with you or still wants to offer love or has love for you while they're still some like with someone else what's this magician reverse about if this is someone that's walking away from a marriage to be with you i don't see that lasting because I have the Knight of Pen uh, Wands reverse with the world reverse. It's like that chapter is not completely closed. Okay, so I just want to say that for some people that are in that situation. Tell me about the Magician reverse. That's way too many. Tell me about the Magician reverse, please. Yeah, Seven of Swords. Be very careful, Sagittarius. Don't trust this person um, 100% because I feel like there's something you don't know. Yeah, this is going to delay a new beginning. King of Pentacles reverse. Be very careful because if they come to offer you this, um, there's something attached to that offer that's not like great. Something that maybe is a little bit sneaky. It's almost like, you know, maybe they um they want to manifest something with you but it's just not 
planned very well or it's not able to be manifested because someone's not doing the right thing or having the right approach here with the seven of swords all right sagittarius i'll leave it there thank you so much for your likes shares and subscribes hopefully you enjoy this bonus reading and i will hopefully see you in another video take care